What's up everyone? Today I'm basically going to go over the new leaks for Apocalypse Rising 2 and give my thoughts and comments on the leaks that I will show soon. When I get done with this video though, if the video is too long after I'm done recording, I will probably make separate videos so it's not a 20 to 30 minute video. That's all I wanted to say though before I get ready to go over the leaks, so let's basically get started. Also, feel free to leave a comment what you think about the leaks or which separate leak you like, what you like about the picture and whatnot, but uh, yeah, let's, um, let's get started. Alright, so the first picture we have is basically lighthouse and with a cool little beach area here. Me being a moderator, I actually have access to the map and I can see everything, so I've already seen most of the map and whatnot but it is a long way from being finished but yeah this is uh this is basically lighthouse the next picture here is basically the new diner that will be added you you have the black and red checkers up top for the trim up there and then you know the checkered floors and stuff like that and the cool seats and stuff but yeah this is basically going to be the new diner for apocalypse rising 2 in the new map this is going to be a very cool area and it is very very compact i would say but it's it's there's not much but i would say like it's basically smuggler's little brother i mean it's like it looks cool it's all boarded up and stuff and basically this place is to keep fish or whatever there's a bunch of fish laying around in the place in this place here and i'm i'm guessing i i don't know what this place is necessarily called but uh i would say it's just like a fish yard or whatever they keep they keep fish over here and uh it's a pretty cool area i do like this area this is the new sports store i'm pretty sure it's the sports or it's another clothing store this is going to be in the new fairview and i'm going to say the new fairview is insanely big so it's going to be crazy and as you can see in the back that door is blocked by this wooden pallet uh that's because it's to reduce lag for the new map the new map is going to have a lot built into it so they don't want every single room to be enterable so they're going to block off a lot of rooms and we got a bunch of skateboards and surfboards and other cool stuff and whatnot hanging up top and it's it's a very nice area i do really like it this area i do really like this is the one of the new like uh gas stations basically they got the building from lulu or basically old chapel or uh lulu island and put it here and then they put a couple gas pipes here gas things here to fill up your cars and stuff like that and it's like a little mini gas station you know you can just come through here and stop and get your gas and then go inside and get whatever you need and that's basically how this is this is the new bowling alley basically that they made um if you're wondering where the back area is to get to the pins you have to go outside and basically go to the back but that area is blocked off like i said they're going to be blocking off rooms i like how the cones are there for the bowling pins that's pretty cool i just i like the way this is turned out for the next picture this modern house here is basically in the new salem this house is really nice as you can see on the second floor these windows are blocked off but most of the rooms down below are enterable and this house is very nice a very nice modern house i think one of the new vehicles spawn here which i will get to soon and as you can see you know there's new lamp posts here and trees in the back and an awesome cool bridge uh don't mind the builder man name i think that's prazzy joking around uh that's not the actual builder man but um i think this is either the new police station or the new courtroom or courthouse um it's very nice it's more modernized than the actual courthouse that we have at ashland and overall this looks pretty nice i think it is finished i think they just have to block off rooms and whatnot and make them non-enterable but overall this is a very very nice building this wheel model here is for the new car that we will see soon in a video that stant has provided us thank you stant but we'll get to this soon this is the new junkyard or as stant likes to call it the dumpy this looks pretty nice for as of now and it will look way better since stant has revamped it and modernized it 
but overall the junkyard is really nice there's a little secret room and there's a picture for that too we'll see what it's like inside but overall it's a very nice junkyard or dumpy i like to call it dumpy this is the new steam area basically i forgot what the name was called for it but this is actually near the new power plant and since volcano is being removed in the new map update labs from volcano those four or five white buildings that are there up top on volcano are near power plant and is near this basically so we'll see if we get more developer leaks with this but for now this is all we have and it looks pretty nice i do like it all right this is a better picture for what we can see here there's oil rig and as i as i told you oil rig is going to be moved more further away from the land here this is a lifeguard tower here for you know the people on the shore and stuff like that so the lifeguard in here can watch the people and whatnot but most of everything here except for the lifeguard tower and the stuff back there everything will probably be revamped these buildings are also in the new salem as you can tell by the lamp posts and there's a hot dog stand right over here that's pretty cool and the laundromat from salem the old salem in the current map is right next to it and there's a huge huge school building i'm pretty sure right next to the hot dog stand and it actually looks pretty cool i do like it this is one of the new cafes in the city of lockport i'm pretty sure this is the new cafe slash library in the new city of lockport and i think it looks pretty nice it's not as detailed as right now i don't think it's done but for as of now this is what they had and yeah that's that's uh, that's what we have for here right now I forgot where this was located at, but this is one of the new computer rooms, or it's a computer store, a tech store, I'm pretty sure. We have a bunch of TVs in the back. We have a bunch of old 80s computers here. I think that's a typewriter. I'm not sure. I don't know if that's a typewriter or, or something. There's a boom box on the left there, and overall, this uh, it looks really, really nice. All right, now we are getting into the new clothing items. I think this is the swat clothing items that are going to be implemented into either the map update or one of the new updates that will come out soon i'm not sure yet gus is wanting to add viewports so it's easier for the icons to be added into the game and with that update i'm pretty sure he's going to have the swat clothing sets in the game as well and overall these look nice i do like the hats i like the helmets here for these guys the holsters the vests and everything else the color the coloring for them is it's really nice i do like these this set is really nice coming back to the junkyard or dumpy this is basically what's inside that big pile of dirt which is a abandoned bus crate and there is a surplus crate that can spawn an m3 tommy those type guns there's basically a surplus crate in the back of the bus and if you can go in it and step in it and whatnot you can basically possibly find yourself a tommy and overall i do like this this is a very very cool area it's nothing simple here it's basically just a dog kennel and the dog water is there as you can see where the question marks and the exclamation marks are at the prison is not on an island anymore surprisingly it is actually just on land where this is at and basically what this is is the new storage units near the junkyard these are one of the new traffic signs that they are adding into the new update this is in i'm pretty sure the new city of lockport where this is at speed limit 25 looks normal looks like what we see nowadays if you're in america this is the official new courthouse for lockport as you can see there's milli tents just like you know basically in ashland the middle part has all the milli tents and all that stuff the military loot there's actually more variety now there's more tents and stuff like that and there's more cover and this is basically the new three-story or four-story because you can get a pop new courthouse for 